Well, you're looking live in Alabama as really, quite frankly, it is stacked against Southern Alabama. Southern Alabama is 0 and 1. And they're going into this game hoping that they can at least come out looking good. If they can come out looking good today, that would be huge. They're in the Gulf Conference. And when you take a look at this, Alabama is 1-0. They beat Troy. Troy is actually in the Florida, con in, uh, Florida Division. And South Alabama lost one. When you take a look, Alabama beat Troy 34-14. They have three ranked teams on their schedule, two in the top ten. On the other side for Southern Alabama, they lost to Georgia only by three points. And they play Alabama next. If they can beat Alabama, they will be one and one in the Gall Conference and play San Jose State and start from there. Southern Alabama at Alabama coming up next. So we're about ready to go. You see, these are really worthless except for this. What a center. Vincent is an unbelievable center. The left end for defense is Miller. He's a 96. And the right outside linebacker, Sanders, is good. The halfback, Powers. The kicker, Gibson. And Stanford, the other halfback. So Powers and Stanford, the halfbacks. And we're ready to go. Here in the rain in Alabama, Tuscaloosa. The hurry up offense of Southern Alabama plays the team of Alabama. And you can see it here, the goal standings. Alabama is 1-0 and, and Southern Alabama is 0-1. You can see all the different teams. Georgia is 22nd ranked with a win over Southern Alabama. Troy is in the Florida division even though they're in Alabama because um, they, they had to. It was just a thing, but you can see the different standings there. Here comes Alabama. Southern Alabama and Alabama. Today's game, Alabama, is a hurry-up offense. And they're going to try and get up early on the road. And it's going to be heads. They were on the road when they lost to Georgia. Remember that. Southern Alabama will get the ball in the second half as they're going to kick off. Alabama will defend, and we're ready to go. The game we're underway. Southern Alabama and Alabama. It's into the end zone. One yard deep and returned up to the 23. Victor Evans, the quarterback, he's a senior. He threw for 317 yards against Troy with two touchdowns. And he's going to start out a first and 10 for Alabama. As we're underway here. Southern Alabama and Alabama, that's nothing. Victor Evans loses four and it'll be second now. That was an absolutely horrible play. And it really was. It'll be second down and 14. They tried an option play, and that didn't even work. Second and 14. Here in the rain, they got trips to the top. The fake they're going to throw. It is complete. And a gain of 10. It'll be third and manageable now. Lionel Charles with the reception. Third down and four. Well, you see the early game starting. 
20 some early game. That should be unique. The throw to the near side, it'll be complete and a first down to Jermaine Ware. Alabama is a type of team. They'll go down the field and they will just take five and six yards on you every play. And nickel and dime it all the way down the field. It'll be first down and 10. The fake, Evans, he'll throw. And he gets a first down, this time a little more. To Lionel Charles, a 20 yard gain. I'll tell you what, Victor Evans is starting out really good. One of the better uh, starts he could have, he's three of three. That third down conversion was big. It'll be first down and 10. I say look for a draw play right here. No, Evans gonna throw. The fourth throw, it's gonna be a screen for the middle. And David Love only gets a yard. Watch this as they throw it right through the middle was a screen and they just, nobody picked up number 58. So second down and nine. Alabama, they always said they want to score in their first three, their first three possessions. They want to score touchdowns. They're going to be really aggressive. Second and nine. Evans, he's got plenty of time to throw. It's complete to the 32. And this is why it's a little different. Now, Troy is losing to an FCS team, FCS Southeast. First down and 10. Alabama only beat him 34-14. This will be up the middle. And David Love gets nine. It'll be second and one. Miami just scored against Colorado State. Miami of Ohio. They're number one. Miami of Ohio is. It'll be second down. That'll be a handoff. They got a lot of good running room there. And David Love is six yards and a first down. Alabama and Southern Alabama. Alabama and Southern Alabama. First down and 10. These teams have been closer through the years than people want to realize. And they throw it out of bounds. It'll be second and 10. Second down and 10. Nine plays, 55 yards. This will be number 10. Second down and 10. The motion from... Near to far, and he goes in the backfield. Here's the option. Running up the middle, and only a gain of three for Victor Evans. It'll be third down and seven. The big third and seven. They can actually have this thing. They can actually stop this. Southern Alabama, the handoff, that's going to be a draw, and he's short. It'll be fourth and three, but they go through the middle, and Alabama's going to try a field goal. This will be 28 yards. This one will be up and over, and it is good. And Alabama has a three to nothing lead. So a very successful first drive. That's 12 or 13 plays. No go in the end zone, they're gonna take a knee. Well, Southern Alabama they're part of the goal division. This is a divisional game here early. Not too much. This is the best the early game that we have. The handoff, it's going to be up the middle. They got two really good running backs. Powers and Stanford. It'll be second down and two. They run that hurry up offense, but they're going to be running a lot. They stop and they watch the sideline to get their play. Back to throw, they're gonna look, they're gonna throw, it'll be a first down to the 39 yard line. Very big for Southern Alabama, this is their first possession. They're down three to nothing, usually they're strong in the first quarter and a half. Back to throw, looking, throwing deep down the middle and intercepted, intercepted, and they're gonna return it to the 50, to the 45, to the 43 yard line, and here comes Alabama. They tried to lead them and go downfield, but it's wet. Nothing really good happening here. Stanford losing to FCS Northwest. The 
as there's two FCS Northwest teams that are playing. And it'll be first down and 10 for Alabama. They're in the gun again. They got four wides with the running back. They fake Evans. He's going to throw it away. He's second down. He was open, but it might have slipped. It'll be second down and 10. Southern Alabama, they're going to try and stop Alabama here. They need to. Evans throws it deep, and he's got him. Oh, he dropped it. He dropped it. He was wide open. And I mean wide open. He was going to score. Third down and 10. Third and 10. They might get enough. There's the blitz is on, they throw to the middle. Now fourth down, are they gonna go for it? Jermaine Ware, and they're gonna punt. So Evans already has thrown nine times. And here's the kick, they're gonna kick. It's gonna be angled, and it'll be, oh, into the end zone. They only held Southern Alabama to 14 yards, but they picked them off, so they didn't really stop. They stopped them on an interception, but not on downs. It'll be first down for Southern Alabama. They got trips three to the top. The handoff, and here it is, up the middle. They're getting a lot of yards running, and they're gonna get 10, 11 actually, Rodney Powers. Florida State, number five. It's seven, seven there. Miami's number one and they're winning seven to nothing. First down and 10. Back to throw, it's gonna be short. And that's gonna be Mike Ray again a seven. It's I think a lot of people, Elliot Little, remember him against Georgia, that was a tough loss. They knew they needed that one. If they would've won that game, this would be for a big division lead. It kind of still is. That's going to be up the middle. And a gain to the 48. Mike Ray, and that'll be a first down. So first down and 10 for Southern Alabama. They bunch to the near side. And here they go, the staff, Little. He's going to look to throw wide open and a first down to Walter Warren. A gain of 16. I'll tell you what, they're hurrying up right now. They got three receivers to the near side. The option, they tackle the running back. I'm not sure how legal that is. That could be defensive holding. It's second and seven. Second and seven. And they're gonna run it to the right-hand side and a first down for Rodney Powers. So Southern Alabama, oh no, it's gonna be third and inches. They need an inch or short. Third and inches, they got two in the backfield now. They're gonna draw it and he's gonna find his way to the 20 yard line. Ralph Stanford, another first down. First down and 10, two backs in the backfield for Elliott Little. The handoff up the middle, and they're getting four or five yards as Ralph Stanford, a gain of four. They're getting a ton of yards here. It'll be second down and six. They got a great kicker. They look to the side. Second and six. Back to throw. Little, he throws. Got it, dropped it. And Little threw it, and it's dropped. With the ground game. Back to throw, they're gonna look, 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 throwing, end zone. He said no, he dropped that one too, out of his hands. And now they're gonna kick the field goal. This will be 33 yards. This will be for Southern Alabama. It'll be up and over and good. And Southern Alabama has tied it at three. It's gonna be deep. 
Into the end zone and taking an aim. One interception. That's it for defense. There's been a lot of offense, believe it or not, in this game. It's 3-3, but they're methodically both running down the field with it. That's right, baby. They don't want it. Play 56. Play 56. And up and nothing there. And Southern Alabama looking good early. Love is stopped. David Love nothing. Second out and nine. Second down, they're gonna fake it. They're gonna pitch to the outside. They got room to run. They're gonna get a first down. Up to the 42 yard line, Lionel Charles. Gain is 16, and look at that, a great pitch, and he just got to the outside. Here in the rain. Down and 10. Evans to throw again. He's looking. He's going to just throw that one away. There's nobody there. Victor Evans. And he's like, you know, why try? You don't want to force it, especially when you have an offense that's moving the ball. It'll be second down and 10. Back to throw. Evans will throw it. It'll be short. They're going to get third down and about three. So David Love with the reception, third down and three. That makes it third and three. Victor Evans, 7-11 for 59 yards. It'll be third down, and they need three. You could look for a draw here, but no. Evans will throw deep and caught. He's gone. Good night, 10-5 touchdown. Jermaine Ware, 51 yards, and now it's 9-3 Alabama. Alabama keep it up it's nine to three Alabama oh my Alabama what a touchdown the extra point is up and it is good well, I mean, when you get open like that, that's another one that they could have gotten. Remember when they scored their three, the play before, two plays before they dropped one. Wow, Marshall's up 24-7 on Duke. Alabama's given up 78 yards so far. That's almost 400 for the game. So it'll be first down and 10. A lot of FCS teams. These teams are playing. First down and 10. Can Southern Alabama keep it up? Back to throw, Elliot Little. And they're gonna get six, second down. They're gonna hit Stanford. They're gonna hit their running backs here. It'll be second down and four. Second and four. And the handoff, and nothing. Powers can't get a thing. Little. On a third and four, they get it. It'll be short by a yard. And now they're going to have to punt it back to Alabama with a minute to go. A lot of games early. And there's the punt. Oh, most. To the 31. To the 40. Up to the 45-yard line, T.J. Robertson. So they've had the ball three times, a touchdown, a field goal, a punt, and a touchdown. So first down and 10 for Alabama. The handoff right up the middle. David Love looking so good as he pulls everyone over. He's already got 30 yards rushing. And it'll be First down and 10. Maybe two more plays if they're not first down. And there is a false start there. False start, offense. 
still first, first down. down. So Alabama, 10 to three, they lead. Back to throw, looking, they're gonna throw down the middle. That'll be a first down. And Southern Alabama with the tackle at Sharon Dodge. Jaron Dodds, I'll tell you what, this Alabama team looks good. They're number 10 in the nation. They're looking for a spot. They are looking for a spot in the playoffs. And it'll be first down and 10. The throw to the middle and a gain of eight. And that'll do it. That'll be the end of the first quarter. So at the end of the first quarter, Alabama's going to have a 10-3 lead, and they're driving for more. get some water and Arizona just scored. Marshall leading by a lot. Boston College leading Coastal Carolina. That ACC conference is tough and that'll be a first down. Five yard reception, it'll be first down and 10. Victor Evans has just been Really good today. I don't know if he'd win the Heisman, but because the Heisman voting is before the playoffs, but Alabama's looking good here early. There's the handoff to Love, and he only gets two. That's David Love. It'll be second down and eight. You can see the offense. Oh, look at number 75. He's just pushing people over. And David Love now nine minutes to go here in the second. Alabama driving, they could lead 17 to three. Army's number eight. That ACC Coastal Division is gonna be big. Back to throw the rollout. Evans will throw and it's complete. The Robertson are only gonna get a yard. They gotta run their routes a little bit better. It'll be third down and eight. Three of five in third downs, trips to the far side. Evans. To love, love through the middle. And now they're gonna try a field goal. So when you hold teams to field goals, that's big. Victor Evans looking very good today, but they can't get a touchdown. This will be 34 yards. It'll be up and it is good. And they're just nailing. Miami, number one in the nation. They're beating Colorado State 14 to seven. Harris is looking really good. The 12 p.m. games here in week two. To the 20, 26 yard line. Off Stanford, Alabama's defense gave up 86 yards in the first quarter. And now they have to at the 26 yard line. Try and stop Alabama, Southern Alabama. Says it's 13 to three. Southern Alabama needs to keep pace. Elliott Little will throw to the middle and it's dropped. You can't do that if you're Southern Alabama, even if it's raining. The Army is getting up big on FCS East. Second and 10. And that's gonna be a penalty and Boston College is leading Coastal Carolina. You look at the bottom of the screen. Texas, UTEP in the Texas League. Illinois in the Central League. Kansas State is losing. Little. And it's incomplete. It'll be third and 15. Birch with the stop. It seems like Southern Alabama is losing a little bit of steam. 
Third and 15 here in the rain, they go doubles. Two to the north and two to the south. Little, he'll throw to the middle and down he goes, Walter Warren. Throw it right down the middle and it is complete, but now they're gonna have to catch. Florida State is tied with an FCS team in the second quarter. And Southern Alabama is gonna have to catch. Alabama, and here it is. There's the punt. It's gonna be to the 26, 27 yard line, and up to about the 46. So a gain of 16 on a return. Alabama is in the position, use some time and score. They might be able to do it. First down and 10, Evans. He's had a hot day today. They got four in the backfield. They hand off. They go inside. And Jermaine Ware gets something and he's hurt. That he is hurt. And, and that didn't look good. Looked like his wrist. Roger, Roger. Mike 56, Mike 56. Red two. Go. Second down. The screen to the near side. He'll get a first down and more. Down to the 40 over one man. Into the 35. That's Lance Stanford. Is he a quarterback? He's number six, he's a junior. Lance Stanford. Is he in for Evans? I don't know. I don't think he is. Evans is still in the game. Stanford is a wide receiver, number six. Back to throw, looking, looking, going deep. He's got a man incomplete. Davis on the stop there. Victor Evans almost had him all the way and it's second down and 10. Mike 56, Mike 56. Second and 10 for Alabama. They throw in the middle, that's Love. Love down to the 25. And David Love a first down. down and 10. There he is right up the middle, Evans, nothing. That really didn't, wasn't designed for too much. It'll be second down and nine. Well, for Alabama to make the playoffs, they would have to handle their conference foes like this. And the top eight teams go in college football. Back to throw, they're gonna throw to the middle to the 20 yard line. It'll be third down and five. And now Alabama might have to kick another field goal and make it 16 to three. Look at FCS Southeast leading Florida State. That's gotta be big. UNC Star Charlotte beating Georgia Southern by a lot. And they're only gonna get a couple down to the 19. And that'll set up a 36 yard field goal for Alabama. They can't get in the end zone. They've only got in once. And that was a long touchdown pass. 224 to 93, and it is up and it is good. If you're only hitting 30 yard field goals, I'd be doing the same thing. Marshall blowing out Duke in the second quarter, Miami leading comfortably. It's Miami of Ohio, in the 23 yard line, Ralph Stanford. I'll tell you what, Southern Alabama needs to score a touchdown here. Halfway through the second, they need to. Starting to get overrun by Alabama. It'll be first down and 10. Back to throw, Elliott Little, he throws. It'll be complete, a first down. Up to the 37 yard line, and that's Brad Wilson. I've noticed they've gone away from the run a lot. They haven't gone to the run. They got two very good running backs, and they haven't been able to go to the run yet. First down and 10. They did early and they had a lot of good success. Little again, Little will throw and that'll be complete. A first down to Brad Wilson again. And again a 12. They're gonna hurry it up again. First down and 10. He fakes, he's just holding it out and he gets clobbered. That looked like it was a broken play 
That's Elliot Little loses four yards. Look at him. He's looking for his running back, and he just gets killed. And that's not what they wanted. They got to huddle up and talk about it. It'll be second down and 14. Miami University up big on Colorado State. That's the way a number one should be, and they missed it. It'll be third and 14. We're down in 14. We got college basketball next. Southern Alabama back to throw. They're going to look, they're going to throw, and incomplete. And now they got a punt. And hopefully, stop Alabama here. Alabama has been dominating now. They're starting to really dominate. They can't score a touchdown now. Miami of Florida is down 10 to seven. A lot of SES teams that are good. The parity is unbelievable. The parity is. Evans throwing the ball is really good. The parity is so much at the FCS that talent has spread so much that a lot of the FCS teams can now compete. We need this 18 playoff, e easily 16. That's to the near side, up to the 30 yard line. It's second down and four. That'll make it second and four. Man left, man left. Alabama, a 10th team. 10th right now ranked. Florida State has tied it up. Against FCS uh, Southeast, they hand off to David Love, and he's going to be a yard short of the third and one. Arizona is up against Fresno State, big. I'll tell you what, the different divisions, the different places in the country, a lot of people are trying to just win their division. That's big enough for bragging rights, and down goes Victor Evans. Clint Jones, his first sack of the day. Good day. Five tackles, two for losses, and one sack. And it'll be fourth down and seven, and now they're going to have to punt. They run 37 plays. 23 have been passes for Alabama. A lot of plays run in this game. Army going up big against their team. It's going to be the punt, 40, 45. He's still on his feet up to midfield, Ralph Stanford. Very good at what he does. Now Powers in the backfield, 255 to go. You know Southern Alabama is going to try and get a touchdown here at least. 16 to 3, Alabama. That's a handoff. He's got room to run. He's trying to follow his blocks. And Roddy Powers gets five. We saw him against Georgia. And in the goal league, Georgia and Alabama. Alabama, if you take Southern Alabama as the consistent team that they both played, is looking. There's the run, Elliot Little, and they guard against the option really well. It'll be third down and five. If you use them as a primary player in Southern Alabama, it looks like Georgia is in for a little bit of a a ride when they play Alabama. It'll be third down and five. That'll be a big game when it happens. Back to throw, a first down to the 34. And Walter Warren, we're not saying Alabama's gonna win this game. We're just saying that Alabama is a tough team. Elliot Little's got this Southern Alabama team on a roll. It'll be first down and 10. Two minutes to go, four in a backfield. They fake, they're gonna run, they're gonna go little. He pitches, it's intercepted! The pitch is intercepted! And he intercepted the pitch! And Andre Potts intercepted it! He knocked over one man and it was intercepted, the pitch! That's gonna be a fumble. It's still, by rule, an interception. Anytime a ball is changes possession, Forward or backward, when it doesn't hit the ground, it's intercepted. And here's Evans. Victor Evans, and what a catch to the 39. Victor Evans. Oh, they're saying no. And it'll be second down and 10. So they're wiping that catch off. Washington State looking good. Second and 10, a short. And Evans gets nothing there. It'll be third down and 10. Southern Alabama wants to get the ball back. 
A little upset at the way that last drive went. It'll be third down and 10. Under two minutes to go, Evans intercepted. Oh, they could go, and he's down at the 32. And a big, this time it's an interception of a forward pass. Oh, what a, it's a lousy day. It is pouring down rain. Watch the curl, watch the curl. And I will tell you this much, it's crazy. First down and 10. That puts Southern Alabama into the game. Elliot Little will throw. It'll be complete down to the 25. It'll be second down and three, and they're going to hurry this up. 90 seconds to go. Second and three. Second down and three, Alabama 16, Southern Alabama three, but Southern Alabama is driving. They've looked a lot better the last couple possessions. Little, they'll throw to the outside, a first down to the 15, to the 13 yard line and a timeout. 1.15 to go. You see Marshall beating Duke and Miami killing Colorado State. Boston College is up big. Elliot Little gets nothing. And another timeout. They got to talk about why that was so terrible. Alabama's up 16 to 3. Kansas State's down 7 to nothing. My goodness. There's the handoff. They got a good handoff to Rodney Powers. And it'll be third down and nine. And they're going to let that clock run to under a minute. Third and nine. They got one timeout. 16 to three. Elliot Little through the middle and incomplete. And now they're gonna try a field goal to make it 16 to six. This'll be 30 yards. He's one for one. He's a great kicker. He's about a 94, I think. And it is up and over and it is good. It's 16 to six. Southern Alabama has made it now a 10 point game. 44 seconds, can they hold for this long? It'll be in the end zone, they're gonna bring it out. The clock will start to the 20, to the 25. 40 plays in the first half. 26 of the 40 have been passes. Unbelievable. People think you run 100 plays in a football game. You don't. You only run 60 to 80, and 80 if you're running a hurry up or everybody throws incompletions. Evans again. Victor, and nothing there, and they might just let this clock run. Mike Stanley with the tackle, and they're going to just let this clock run. Evans, and it'll run down. Well, actually, they're going to... They're gonna try another play here. Second and 10. I wouldn't be too quick. Check, check. Dancer, dancer. Victor Evans might just hold on to this thing. Let's see. He might hold on to very, very late. He might just throw one more long pass or they might just let him run to nothing as we're down to seven seconds. And that's what they're doing right now. And they jump off, they, they jump. So Alabama's probably just going to run one play, and that's going to be Still it. Second, second and 15. They might just chuck it up there as far as they can. Victor Evans looking good, but they don't want to turn it over here. They'll just hand it off to Love, and he gets bashed in the backfield. And at the half, Alabama, 16 to 6 lead. division game. I mean, it's pouring down rain. It's kind of sloppy. But the turf here in Alabama is good. I mean, it is good. There he 
you see Alabama over 200 yards. South Alabama, 145. It's 221 to 145. They almost double time of possession. Powers deep to return. Here's Powers, he's rated in the 90s, and he's good. Southern Alabama, look at this, 75 plays. Now, usually 120, 160 is the upper echelon of plays that you run in a game. Now that'll come down because the team with the lead is gonna run the clock off. Here's Elliott Little, and he goes for four. Second and six. Second and six now. For Southern Alabama. They need an early, a good possession here up to the 41. That's Mike Ray. They're going to take a first down with nine and a half to go. 21 14, Florida State is leading. Texas in the Texas League doing their business. Old Dominion over South Carolina. That's a good one. Elliott Little again. He's going to hold it, and Elliott is trudging along, and he gains six. Weird-looking tackle there. It'll be second down and four. But they got to wonder, and you have to wonder, when you start to take time off the clock, you're burning yourself out with an... Hurry up offense. The pitch to the near side, and Powers gets nothing. It'll be third down and four. They're trying an option play with the quarterback with the speed of that paint in the middle of the field. Going nowhere, drying. Third and four. Little, the throw, it's a first down. And to the 41-yard line, Brad Wilson. I mean, let's put it this way. Elliot Little. Elliot Little has to use a calendar when he runs a 40. First down and 10. It is loud. They got all four in the backfield. They hand it right up the middle. And that's a gain of 11 for Rodney Powers. And there's somebody injured. It's number 81. So it isn't Rodney Powers. Look at Southern Alabama's yardage. They're coming back. Totally different than the game against Georgia. And Stanford lost one. It'll be second and 11. Right in the backfield, oh yeah, number 63 couldn't keep on his block. It's gonna be second down. Back to throw, back to throw, and down he goes, it's a fumble! They count it as a fumble, and that's big for Alabama! Alabama 16 to six, they say no good. And maybe that might be coming back, but it looks like he threw the ball. But the referee said no, he fumbled, and they might take, no, it is a fumble. And he fumbled the football, and they weren't buying the pass. So it'll be first and 10. And the pitch to the outside to Love, and he'll get one, maybe, or two. David Love, a gain of two, it'll be second and eight. That makes it second and eight. Bama 16, Southern Alabama six. Back and there's Evans. Oh, what a catch, he could go. 10-5, he's in, touchdown, Anthony Morris. And that's the break that Alabama needed. They were in an offensive funk. And Anthony Morris, a deep throw, and what a catch. And that's big. Now Southern Alabama's in a whole world of trouble now. 22 to six, and now Alabama the extra point. And here it is, it is up and it is good. And Alabama, 23 to six lead.
Wilson for Southern Alabama, Bruce Sternum. Florida and FIU, that's going to be a crazy game. And we're going to have that for you. And that's going to be our late game of the week, three against 13. That'll be big. Every game is big. You only play 11 or 12. First down and 10. It's now 23 to 6. Back, and that's going to be the handoff up the middle. And a gain of five. They can do this still. They can get gains of five. They can go down and dun -dun -dun, right down the field and not have to worry about the time and score three times. They need two touchdowns and a field goal. It'll be second and five. And Elliot Little gets something, and you're not going to win any games doing that. It'll be third down to nine. Yep. That was terrible. Third and nine. Washington State has given up 21 straight. That's going to be the draw, and they can't get the they can't get the block. It'll be fourth and nine, and now they're going to catch. Fourth and nine, and there's the punt. Alabama at the 31, up to the 39 yard line, DJ Robertson. Alabama looking good. Victor Evans. And Victor Evans a first down. UNC Charlotte is killing Georgia Southern. Evans deep and incomplete. Terry Richard with the deflection and Southern Alabama needs a stop here. They need one stop. And if you're Alabama, you're gonna try and run the clock down and if they score again, it's gonna be over. Second down, Evans. They're gonna throw to the middle and down he goes again a five, David Long. Third down and five. Halfway through the third, it's 23 to six, Alabama. Alabama starting to take the game over again. Evans, and that's incomplete. Now South Alabama will have the ball. Victor Evans already 20 and 30. That'll bring up fourth and five. 244 yards. And that ball is out of the end zone. That's not great. In the first half, he was all right. He was good. In the second half, I mean, it's first half to the second half. But. First down for Southern Alabama. And the 21 yard line. I mean, this, I think Southern Alabama has a case of, they got the wrong players for the system. You get that sometimes, especially in football. It happened in the 72, what the heck was that? What in the world was that? I don't know what that was. It's third down and nine. The center getting tackled. Back to throw, looking. Elliot Little will throw. He got, oh, he dropped it. Can't blame Little on that. It's going to be fourth down. <sighs> 23 to 6. Alabama leads, and there's the punt. I think, you know, they got two big running backs for Southern Alabama, and you haven't heard their name in a while. And when you hear their name, it's predictable. Clemson 17 to 7 over the FCS team. New Mexico winning. Miami is now winning. There's the handoff. Oh, and he's hit hard. David Love, look at this head. Look at this. Oh, my. Oh. You want to talk about crush. 
Oh my goodness, were they crushed there. Second down and seven, and they moved. The flag, number 76, he moved. And it'll be second and 12. Still second down. Number one, Miami of Ohio. They're going to be a tough team. We're going to have that game against Ohio State. That'll be a great game. You know that'll be a great game. The fake, Evans. Evans will throw, and it is incomplete. It'll be third and 12. You know, Ohio State and Miami have played really great games, and Miami of Ohio has owned that series. They really have. Evans, that's going to be complete to the 38. And let's see, are they going to go for it? It's fourth and three. It's in no man's land, really. And they're going to go for it. Between the 30 and the 40 is no man's land. You just don't know. You, you, you could do anything, but fourth and three. Evans, he'll throw it. It is complete. He gets it down to the 16. Alabama wants to... Well, I'll tell you what, they want to end this thing oh, right over 31. That was either a great pass or a terrible one. Depending on your point of view, Brady threaded the needle, but if number 31 were looking up in the air, oh my goodness, that would have been it. First down and 10. The fourth down conversion, here's David Love, right up the middle, David Love to the five yard line. And a gain of 11. They're on the doorstep. And they're about to go up 30 to six. This would be impressive over Southern Alabama. Up the middle, touchdown. Chad Hold, a five yard run. Extra point is up and it is good. 30 to six, Alabama lead. Southern Alabama, I'll tell you, they, they need they need to score on this one if they want any chance. They're down 24. Three full touchdowns. A full touchdown is six points. They've already run 100 plays. 346 to 185 over double. No, not that's not over double. Double would be 370. First down, Southern Alabama. Little and up to gain of three, four. Second down and six. Back to throw, looking, looking. They're going to throw. It's going to be lofted and almost intercepted. Corey McNeil is there, it'll be third and six. Alabama's gonna get in a mode here that they just don't wanna get anybody hurt. What an, this is impressive. Georgia had trouble. Southern Alabama gave Alabama trouble. The throw to the near side and that's incomplete. Fourth and six and now they're gonna punt. They gave Alabama trouble for a little bit, and Alabama just came out and said, oh, nope. There's the punt. Look at FCS Northwest. They're winning. And that kick return down to the 42, DJ Robertson. 2.09 to go. They just want to milk the clock here. It'll be first down for Victor Evans. The fake, the throw, and incomplete. Victor's 22 of 34 today. I mean, the day is, it started off really good, but now it's starting to get average. Second and 10, back to throw again. Evans is screened, a love. He's only going to get about three here. It'll be third down and seven. So 
third and seven for Alabama. Three of 11 on third down. Back to throw Evans. He'll throw down the middle and that'll be a first down, a fumble, and it's gonna be picked up by Southern Alabama. So Southern Alabama, it'll be a first down. Yeah, I mean, his feet were on the ground and he made a move. Southern Alabama down 30 to six, a minute and a half to go. Back to throw, Elliot Little. He's gonna throw it deep. He got a man down to the 40, to the 39, and a first down. They're gonna hurry it up, a first down and 10 for Southern Alabama. 30 to go. Back to throw, they're looking, throwing down the middle, and that's gonna be a couple. Rodney Powers, and they gotta use their running backs. Now, biggest three, it'll be 30 to nine, which will mean 21 points, but they're looking for a touchdown here. If it's close, they're gonna go for it. Second and two. And that's gonna be complete, a first down, down to the 20 yard line. Rodney Powers again. Using the backfield, and right now Alabama is having trouble. This is a goal division game. The SEC, the Georgia Alabama League. Back to throw, they throw it in incomplete. All the teams from Georgia, all the teams from Alabama. Minus Troy, because Troy's right next to Florida, and he needed to balance everything out. Florida State not looking the greatest. Here's Little again, and he's gonna hold, and nothing going. Not the greatest running back in the world. It'll be third down and 12, and you can see that Elliot Little just slow. Third and 12 for Southern Alabama. They need these next two downs. They will throw, and it'll be a first down and goal. Mike Ray. Half a minute to go here in the first quarter. We're going to do basketball. That'll be big. A first down and goal. And they're going to fake. Here's Elliot Little. He's not going to get much. He gets zero, and they're going to have to struggle back to the line. Elliot Little looks to be hurt. Kelly a little, no, they got a new quarterback here. I wonder what happened to Little. And that's gonna be it. So they have a new quarterback. I don't know whether he's gonna stay in or not, but this is it for South Alabama. They have to score or else this thing is over. Elliot Little is back in the game. They had somebody there. They let the quarter run out. Back to throw Little, and he'll throw it away. And I don't know, maybe let the other guy come in if that's going to be what happens. It'll be third down and goal. Four at 12 and third down. Back to throw with Southern Alabama. They're gonna take a look, Elliot Little, and touchdown. Ralph Stanford, and it's 30 to 12. They need the extra point. They need the two point, con oh. Oh, it looked like his foot was on the line, but they're gonna go for two anyway. Well, they need the two point conversion. It's 30 to 12. Back to throw, Elliot Little, touchdown. And it's 30 to 14. Look at Ralph Stanford. And he gets drilled in the end zone. That was good. Alabama 30, Southern Alabama 14. And they'll take an aim. Look at Alabama, my goodness. First down and 10, 9.50 to go. It's a 16-point game. They get three in the backfield. 
There's the screen. And David Love, David Love. That's a gain of six. David Love, that's exactly what they want to do. Short passes, control. Second down and four. They got to get their rushing numbers up, and they know it. Here's David Love. He's going to be a yard short. It'll be third down and one. David Love, nine minutes. Back to throw, they're looking, 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 throwing deep, a wide open, he's gone. Good night, he's down to actually to the 10 yard line, Anthony Morris. Anthony Morris, three receptions, he's averaging 44.3 yards a reception. He's been incredible, he's been like Lynn Swan numbers. And it'll be first down and 10. 30 to 14. First down and 10. Evans through the middle. And he's got to the four yard line. It'll be second now. Alabama's going to win the game here. They're up by 16. A field goal would be damaging. But that's even more. Trent Clark, a touchdown, and that's it. Third touchdown of the day for Victor Evans. Clark nailed it in five plays, 72 yards. Good night. And this extra point is down 37 to 14. There's the catch. Twenty, thirty, thirty-six yard line, and there it is. The defenses are doing certain things, but it'll be first down. They got trips to the near, doubles to the north. Little, they're down by twenty-three, and that's Corey Lynch. Make it second and, four. and they're gonna hurry it up. Second down and four. Let's go, let's bring it. Let's bring it. Mike 51, Mike 51. So second Quick, down and four now. Little. He'll look, he'll throw it to the far side, and he's hit. He gets a first down. That makes it first and Right to Courtney Harmon. Oh, the clock is moving. First down and 10, Little in the old shotgun, the six yard one. The Notre Dame one of the late 80s, the John Elway one. Little, he'll throw to the middle and knocked away. It'll be second and 10. Second down and 10 for Southern Alabama. 23 is the lead. Back to throw is Little. He'll throw it down the middle, and that'll be a first down to Courtney Harmon. Seven and a half to go. First down. And the clock is ticking. UNC Charlotte, my goodness, 56-17 over Georgia Southern. First down and 10. In the age of parity, that is rare. Little and nothing. It'll be a gain of three. Second down for Carter. Carter gets it. Elliot Little, 234, a touchdown and an interception. Southern Alabama will go to 0-2 in a division with two big losses, but they're not giving up here at all to the 32. They're down by 23 with seven minutes to go. Do have all three timeouts, and they wouldn't need an onside kick if they can force three and out. Now 
Elliott incomplete. It'll be third, second, and ten. Third down and two. Two down, two down. 42 passing attempts. Bama is just looking good. Third and two. The handoff. Should have done more of this. They're going to get a first down. And they run over people. And they get out of bounds. Rodney Powers. And again, they should have done more of that. First down and 10. Bama leading 37 to 14. Back to throw is Ellie a little down to the middle. Again, a seven for Mike Wright. Well, for Southern Alabama, you got to score every time you got the ball. You got to hit two out of three. You got to hit your first two two point conversions because you know you're going for two. Back to throw. They're gonna throw to the near side. Good night, good night. He's gone. There is just gonna be, he's out. Look, nobody's even in the camera. Nobody's in the camera and Alabama's gonna have a big lead now. Brandon White and that's the game. Any faint pulse is now flatline. And Alabama has won this game. It's now 43 to 14, and he just goes all the way. Five forty-six to go, and here's the extra point. And it is up and good. And Bama in a blowout now against Southern Alabama. And here's the kick. And it'll be deep. Into the end zone, one yard deep. And they're gonna return it, now he goes. Well, you see 131 plays. But you look at the total yards, Alabama's up and not on first downs because of big plays. Mississippi State loses and all Florida State barely beats an FCS team. Shows you parody, and that's going to be incomplete. Elliot Little. Second down and 10. 540 to go here in the game. There's the draw play, and up the middle, nothing. Heath Arnold. Third down and eight. Go to their normal hurry up offense. Elliott. And it is wide open and complete, and he makes a first down. They needed eight, they got nine. It'll be a first down halfway through. 29 of 46, 266 with a touchdown and two interceptions. They got three to the bottom. Back to throw, they throw it through the middle. Stanley and a gain of four, and they gotta hurry it up. That makes it second and six. Down by 30. Well, Alabama, it's a good start, it really is. Back to throw, and now goes Elliott Little. It'll be third down and 14. Miami's gonna kill Colorado State, D.C. beating Coastal Carolina big, Arizona up big, Little through one, he'll throw, he gets away, fourth down and 14. And now they're gonna kick, and I think Alabama's just gonna run this clock out if they can. And there's the punt. To the 31. 
44 to 14, Alabama leads Southern Alabama. And they're gonna throw Evans again incomplete. Why they do that, I have no clue. Seriously, 361 yards, three touchdowns. I understand it's the very beginning and you wanna do certain things offensively. It'll be second and 10. They're gonna throw, it'll be complete, and now he goes again a one. Third and nine. Wanted to try and get something here. Alabama, they're gonna throw again. Two out of three they throw, and it's incomplete. Fourth down and nine, and now they're gonna catch. Deep, that's to the 23, and up to the 35. First and 10. Elliot Little. And he's got a good offensive line. For the game of 10. Well, they're not there. They're not there. They really aren't. But they have enough that they can get a lot of wins this year and look good doing it. Back to throw Little again. He'll throw an incomplete. 50 passes this game. This has been a pass fast. Second out and 10. If you're Bama, you just want to run out the clock when you get the ball. Little again. Pulls and intercepts. No, all incomplete. Third down and 10. Seven of 16 for Southern Alabama on third down. Throw in and almost intercepted. That's Kurt Birch. Now they're gonna punt Alabama, who's gonna just try and get a first down and win this thing. And here's the punt. There it is. The 16. Love. And no, that's CJ Robertson. Sorry. Alabama, they look good. They're in a tough division. They have three ranked opponents all year. And they have yet to play them. They're gonna be 2-0. and They certainly proved they're number 10 today. They certainly did. And if I were the pollsters, though, it depends on what other people do. And there's... And down he goes. So the best for Alabama is if Florida International beats Florida. The top eight go no matter where they are. Third and eight. A minute and a half. Victor Evans, he'll hand it off and he'll go right up the middle. And it'll be fourth and five and now they're gonna catch. Alabama with a big win today against Southern Alabama has just shown that the goal division is shaping up to be Alabama and Georgia. Whenever they play, that's gonna be a big game. Of course, you have teams like Florida State. Oh, Kansas State lost to an FCS team. But I'll tell you, you know, you have teams like Florida State and you have a lot of teams from the Florida division and they're gonna play Florida State and Alabama, that'll be a big game. You have a lot of big games. It's Rodney Powers, and it'll be first down for Southern Alabama. They just want to get out of here with everybody intact. They got trips to the near side. They hand it off, and they should have been doing that more this game. They know it. And the timeout. They don't have a bad offensive line. They're just not there in cohesion. They're not there in coaching staff. They're not there in play selection. But they have talent. If they put it together, they could really be a force against anybody. 
They almost were against Georgia, and I'm not so sure Georgia is that bad of a football team. Second and 10. They got one timeout left for Southern Alabama. Back to throw, they're gonna throw it away. Arizona, a big win. Now Arizona, they're out in the West. They're looking, they're looking good in the Mountain West. There's a run up the middle. That'll be a first down and more. And down at the 34. They're gonna hurry this thing up. But you know, you got Arizona, they're gonna be representing, maybe. They gotta get through their thing. You got Army, who's there? Army's gotta be Navy. Navy's always tough, remember for Navy. For the first 30, 35 years, it was Navy. Maybe wanting to win a national championship and they didn't. Vision 2040. 10 seconds, Elliot Little. And they're gonna go to the 30 and that's just gonna be the football game. I don't think they're gonna, they're not gonna get it. Not at 44 to 14. Alabama, a big win, 44 to 14. We're gonna do everything. We're gonna simulate everything. Evans, you can see what a heck of a performance it was for him. And Alabama's gonna win this game. Thank you for attending today's ball game. Please drive home safely. Alabama 44, South Alabama 14. And I guess the biggest thing is we're gonna go. And we're gonna have our, we're gonna have our post game show here. Forty four to fourteen. And that interception just won it all. It was thirty seven to fourteen. And South Alabama was trying to make it like thirty seven to twenty two. And that just did it. As you take a look here, the game stats, team stats really quickly, uh, 440 to 369, uh, 85 plays to 68, 85 for South Alabama. They're really running a hurry up, but they turned it over four times. When you take a look at the punts, there were 13 punts in this game. And it's just four penalties. Well, that's going to be it for us. Now we're going to go to the post-game show. We're going we're to simulate everything. And we're going to simulate the rest of the games of the week uh, for some of them. And there you see some of the games right here early on. So let's take a look. at the subs, at the simmed games, the 12 o'clock games. Tulane and Texas A&M. And this one is Texas A&M 28 to 20. They're one and oh, Purdue and Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh hoping to get off to a good start, Pitt does. They were 17-14, they bashed them in the third quarter, that was big. Duke and Marshall. Marshall beat Duke as we saw, 38-24. UNC Charlotte and Georgia Southern. This was big, UNC Charlotte all the way. They had a big second quarter. This game wasn't even close, it was 31-7. 37 to 7. Sorry, they scored late. 
They actually missed the kick. Boston College and Coastal Carolina. And Boston College won big 42 to seven. Kansas State, we saw them lose this game to an FCS team, 13 to seven. That wasn't good. And when you take a look at Troy, Troy beat the FCS Southeast. And that was big there. Stanford. And Stanford lost 35-21 to the Northwest FCS. Same with the Northwest against Mississippi State. They're not bad. And against Washington State. Another Northwest team loses barely. As Washington State scores late in the game. Rice in the Southeast. And Rice wins 35 to 16. Florida State. And the Southeast Florida State wins 28-23. We saw this game. Well, we heard about it. Old Dominion. And South Carolina pulls it out 21 to nothing. And they score with 624 to go in the game. Fresno State, Arizona. We watched Arizona win this one. 38 to 14. They were big. They're still number six. UTEP out of the Texas League. UTEP 38-16. Illinois we saw with a big lead against their FCS 30-3. FCS East and Army we saw Army a big lead. And Army won at 49-10. Clemson we saw them struggling a little bit early but then they pulled away 30-7. New Mexico how about them the Lobos. 31-24 uh, over the same Northwest team that gave a lot of other people trouble. Remember Miami? This was a tough one for a little bit. It was 28-17 and then they pulled away. Maryland was in a tussle against FCS East and they ended up winning 28 in the second half. Texas Pulls away in the Texas League. They look good. And finally, Utah and Memphis. And 38-31. Utah scores late. They scored the last two touchdowns. It was 38-17. So when you take a look at the 330 games, here's what you have. LSU at Louisiana Monroe, number nine, LSU. Air Force at number 23, Tennessee. Texas State and USF, Southern Florida. Louisville is at Michigan. Kent State at Louisiana Tech. Houston at Oregon State. Wake Forest and USC. Uh, San Jose State against an FCS team. Missouri against FCS. Appalachian FCS. Ohio against FCS, Bowling Green FCS, UTSA at FCS, UAB, Eastern Michigan, Iowa, Toledo, and all at FCS is Syracuse at Notre Dame. That's a big one. So really not that much, possibly Syracuse and Notre Dame. Notre Dame unranked, but they are looking very good. Wake Forest and USC. This could be a surprising one. Houston and Oregon State. I think we're gonna be Wake Forest and USC. Louisville and Michigan, I don't see that being an upset. Texas State and UCF, that'll be not bad. Air Force and Tennessee. Tennessee looking good and Louisiana and Louisiana Monroe. That's gonna be it for us today. We'll see you next time. Have a great day. We'll see you for college basketball.